hi guys so welcome back to my channel it's your girl Hawa and today we're going to prepare mashed potatoes and beef so here is me boiling the potatoes added some warm water and I make a salt so right away unafa uchemshe kwanza majimoto because using cold water will take some time so some you cover it up wait for 15 minutes and now these are the ingredients onions coriander beef uh some tomatoes salt and black pepper these are the ingredients for today and i also have some garlic garlic nime bonda bonda kiasi that's half a kg of meat is it half or a quarter so after 15 minutes the pot the potatoes are ready and it's time to fry the beef upon him on get my onions in hot oil preheated just a little bit koroga koroga hapana pale and then once you're done with that sorry about the smoke we go on and mash our potatoes so i have this katul of mine which i use to mash the potatoes uh remember they boiled for 15 minutes and now they are ready this is a tough work you have to let them cook so well done with that part i continue mashing all through again sorry for the smoke this is normal in the kitchen and i'm videoing myself so just understand me so the, you, this tool is a necessity you need to get it to mash your potatoes so the recipe of mashed potatoes here we are and once i'm done with that what i'm going to be doing next i'm taking the onions while i'm frying them i'm preparing onions making sure they've turned golden brown sorry about the beef but uh, i from the freezer that i still had and since i was in a hurry I just had to do what I gotta do. So I added some hot water direct to it. This is my method of cooking. If you have yours, well and good. This is how I do it. I leave it to boil for some um, few minutes. Cover it up. You can add salt as well. And then just cover it up for some time and let the beef boil until the water is almost over. So again, this is the potatoes that set aside. And now I want to fry them too. So in another sufuria, add in your damn look at that sufuria the way it's so clean add some oil to it just a little bit then add your onions and once you've added the onions what you do is just tire start keep stirring them don't let them turn to golden brown that much okay so just a little bit make sure they cook a little bit and once that's done now take your potatoes mashed potatoes and add direct to the onions once you've done that you're going to just stir fry them a little bit um you can choose to add some milk i've added milk i guess so yeah uh around half a cup of milk and then you just mash it like unapika ugali as if you're making some ugali okay just mash it just sit around play along with it ensure everything is well incorporated in and the heat should be low at this particular point remember i'm not adding salt because i added salt previously when i was boiling the potatoes uh, i used around 17 potatoes for two people and here is our beef the water is almost done or over and i've added the garlic i used two cloves of garlic because this is just a small dish and i don't want to use a lot just stir through ensure everything is incorporated well and once that is done you have to hear the sound of shh. that's when you know your beef is ready and just stir, keep on stirring through guys ensure nothing burns at this point when everything is done just add in your throw in your tomatoes right this is two tomatoes diced into perfect size perfectly done so i'm going to cover it up and let the tomatoes mash and before that i'm adding my black paper just a little bit remember black paper is a little bit um is it sour how can i say i don't know how to put it but it's, if you put too much of it you're gonna destroy the flavor of the food so yeah just cover it up you can choose to add some water and then once you've covered it for some time this is how it looks not perfect perfectly smashed but this will do just throw in your coriander leaves some people call it cilantro dania yeah just garnish it with the coriander don't let it cook too much 
you just add some Royco if you prefer, right? So here comes along my Royco. I'm choosing it beef, beef flavor. This is not an ad, it's not a sponsored video, so just add in a little bit. You can either do half a teaspoon or one tablespoon on your preference, guys. So just uh, stir everything right to make sure everything is incorporated in well for the flavors and all and yeah once that's done i added some bit of water not much remember how to pick zupu just add some amount uh, a small amount of water and stir it through and let it boil for around two to three minutes and then turn down your heat uh, this this video is not doing justice to this and this is what we have it's done okay with some avocado hapana pile to ensure everything tastes nice oh my god guys you see how pretty it looks i tell you this dish is so yummy so guys please if you like this video remember to like comment share and subscribe to my channel it's your girl hawa and peace bye guys Mwah.